Yeah, I can't tell if we are driving on the left or right. Sun slightly to the south. This could again be the Philippines. Hi, and welcome to another day of the challenge video. Yesterday, I only had one guess in the right country. That was the one in Madagascar. My other guesses, especially the one in, in uh, Ecuador, were quite far away. Uh, and I ended up with a bronze score of 11,600 points. I am playing with no move panel zoom. Let's see how I do today. Let's go. So let's see what kind of language we have here. We have some Spanish. Um, we have a 787 number. Also, we are lacking uh, front number plates. Uh, so we are in Puerto Rico. Oh no, more or less east-west dual carriageway. Speed limit is only 40. It goes slightly northeast, so it could be somewhere like here so, so this road here is definitely going in the right direction I'm not sure if this is a uh, normal uh, normal dual carriageway uh, does have some ramps so it looks more like a motorway this one on the other hand maybe fits a bit more i think it's going a bit too much towards the north There's one thing going for this road here, and that's the fact that we have a massive sign there. I was, I, I mean, it could still be here. One thing that doesn't go for this one is the fact that on the map, the buildings appear to be all the way into the road, uh, whereas we can not uh, see that they're not. I'm going to have a look around here again, this road. This one seems more like I can't see any of these junctions in the background. Uh, that's the only thing. As I can tell, I haven't been able to find any of the company names I see either. Oh, found it. Found that one. I'll go some more. See there. Right, perfect score. I found it like last second. Um, very good. Um, so yeah, uh, I haven't had a perfect score in ages in the daily challenge, so I'm happy with that. Right, this one, mm, I don't really know where this is. Somewhere in Europe, we have some ditches in the, um, oh, on either, either side. This could be anywhere. Could be UK, could be Germany, France, Belgium. We don't have the typical Belgian ditches, but I wouldn't really discount any of them. But I'm going to go Germany, I think, and then hope I'm right. Yeah, that was France. Quite far away. That's a Peruvian flag. I think it is one there as well. I'm presuming we are in Lima. It's a Peruvian flag. Kind of fits with the cars. Um, 
Trump's direction you can't really see, but I'll say we are in Lima. Guessing that's some sort of presidential palace or similar. To be honest, I have no idea where it is. Could be this thing here. Yeah, that fits with the building. In which case? It doesn't fit with the uh, road here, though. It's for the building. We almost have the shape of the building here as well. Put a marker down. I I'm going just going to guess there. Uh, yep, another perfect score. Uh, so uh, it's two in one uh, one daily challenge. Again, doesn't happen a lot. Okay, we're driving on the left. No, on the right. Even. Yeah, I'm not sure about this one. Oh, kind of reminds me of someone like Cambodia or the Philippines. I don't know these poles. Seen this kind of pole before? Some could be to the north, slightly to the north. I'm gonna go Philippines, but don't know. Okay, it was Philippines. Uh, but much further to the north. But finally, we are leaving Lagi, wherever that is. Lassi, David. Um, yeah, I can't tell if we are driving on the left or right. Some slightly to the south. This could again be the Philippines. Like if you go up here. The fact that we have English. Yeah, I think English could be uh, could be a clue name. So, so for me, it's either between between Ghana, uh, just because of the landscape, and uh, the English and the Philippines. I think Ghana is a bit. It's a, it's a bit too dry, or it looks a bit too too different, uh, the parts that I know of Ghana. I'm working, working on my theory that we are around here somewhere. I don't think I'll find it, to be honest. All right, let's just get the Philippines again, the wrong part. Um, so all in all, pretty good. Um, I'm happy with both of my guesses in the Philippines. Two perfect scores, um, one in Peru, one in Puerto Rico. Uh, only one in the wrong country, that was the one in France. But yeah, all in all, really good. As always, if you like these videos and would like to see some more, please consider subscribing to the channel. Also, hitting the like button and leaving a comment. And I shall see you again tomorrow for another data challenge.
Bye for now.